All right, what is up, you guys? And of course, as always, welcome back to another Wi-Fi Bell. Now, today we're going up against um, Paulina and in OU battle, as always, and uh, kind of worried. Kind of worried. Oof, this is a good team, though. This is absolutely some type of. Um, or what do you call it? Uh, you call it stick web team. Stick web, sticky web. Um, do I have anything that makes sense here? Do I have soul stats on Zyza? And in theory, it does outspeed everything. Shuckle always has like t no Memento, Stealth Rock, Sticky Web, can have an Encore, can be extremely disruptive and. Uh, Actually, not to think about it. Like, I probably want to lead off with Emolga because I don't see a Pokemon here that is grounded, so I can freely Volt Switch on anything he lead he leads off with. Now, I don't have any Defogger, which means there are going to be situations here that I just lose, and that's exciting. <laughs> I think Obstacle would have done right here, uh, pressure me quite naturally. And there are I have three Pokemon that are susceptible to um, and what do you call it? That are susceptible to a stick web. So there's always going to be a frustration about that. Here comes Shuckle. There is nothing to it. There's nothing I can do to stop it either. And um, I've seen this set before without it revealing anything. Um, that is just stick web and uh, stealth rocks then uh, just a combination of really nasty stuff <laughs> so the way I see it there are two ways I can get myself in a good position but it is granted that uh, she goes all the way through with uh, the setup because like that stuff rock stick web usually memento or uh, toxic there's a stick web nice Charles so what stands here usually these carry either metal herb or leftovers but I think this is a mental herb variant so stealth rocks there it is. We keep soul stancing because uh, there is no other play. Because if I fail to KO a uh, Shimamento, then it doesn't matter. Encore. There it is. There it is. That means it doesn't have any attacking move. Withdraws a shuckle. Goes to Toxtricity. Now, I do have two ways of playing this. Um, I think I can abuse this to an extent. Get my motor drive, that is. Overdrive to my motor drive. <laughs> um, now I have no way of attacking besides Thunderbolt or Air Slash to potentially flinch. I guess that makes sense. Just get some chip here. Avoided attack. All right, so that's that's my punishment. <laughs> Fine. Fine. I'm not mad. So All right. Sometimes I think this game doesn't hate me, but definitely don't enjoy me. Now here's the thing, I think I can stomach a hit. Here's a Volt Switch, nothing to it. 
so we go for rock polish and uh, I guess I regret a little bit in the attack that chuckle obstacle all right cool we'll see how much this meter beam does um, the only benefit they have versus Obstagoon is uh, that I, I, you know, clearly heard it. Not while well I'm actually stop. I'm very glad she didn't go for an, an obstructor just to force my hand. This meter beam maybe won't KO, but I'm sure as hell will do a whole lot of damage. And sometimes that's enough. Because we're gonna get sweep by uh, Shell Smash Blastoise anyway. Nice. Cool. So Obstagoon is obsolete. But versus Blastoise, like, there's Earth Power. That's the only thing I can do. Well, that was kinda nice. <laughs> it's one of those things, like, I enjoy it because I feel my play was justified somehow. Breviary. Okay. I do carry ice beams. So I'll I'll do that. I have no idea how much it will do though. Not a KO, unfortunately. Oh. Oh. Okay. Hype was over. Uh, <laughs> Iron Head. So sheer force life orb. Okay, I like that. Hang in there. Will I knock off? What could even the play be here? Right, besides saying, gonna knock off the life orb. I so badly want to try something different. Assault Vest? Hello. So it could have KO'd. Cool. Brings in Toxtricity. I'm not a big fan of this guy. Knockoff won't KO. Boombirds will destroy me. Do I even have a switch in? Like, I like her team, but this is this is rough. Because I don't want to risk anything. I gotta do it. I gotta break this guy somehow. Overdrive. That's gonna pop me clean off. So what I need now is the Crocodile Scale Shot somehow gets me where a point where I can, you know, potentially outspeed everything she got. And I don't die to Boom Burst. Because if I get myself at plus one, I do outspeed everything besides Steel Valley, that is, so it's not perfect. So one Boom Burst coming right up. She's thinking though, maybe what if he scarfed? What if he ruins my life and decided to say no? Uh, okay, we took it, but I think we died to scale shot. Oh, I only got two! Damn it! I was kind of hoping to kind of clutch it and survive the um, aftermath of life orb, which I will, but um, damn it. Damn it! I think that was my last shot of getting this right. Hold on. Oh, it's so it's so bad. It's so bad. I can't win now. There's no way. I send in Majin Buu, and quite frankly. 
I have no idea what to do. Can I get my competitive? And I'm gonna lock myself in the Dazzling Gleam. Grip Claw. So no facing, I guess. By the way, I only hope she goes for Memento. So I get all the boost. Wrap. Well, that's alright. So only one attacking move, and that was Wrap. Oh, crit, cool. Alright, what kind of Sylvalia are we dealing with here? There's a wrap. Does nothing, but the residual will do a lot more. Because it's wrap. I'm kind of worried, like I feel, I feel I did a few plays right, but at the same time, this Shuckle absolutely destroyed me. Now, had I Dynamax with, with Scyther, I would have won, but I didn't want to, I didn't want to beat that guy. At this point, I feel it's anybody's game. I really hope this is uh, not a white herb with Blastoise. Shell Smash, cool. Because as far as she is aware, I am still not revealed myself to be a soul vest. Don't be white herb, damn it. Right, how much will I do? I'm not in range. I am not in range. Oh, and she dynamaxed. So with that in mind, I should have just won. Fine. <laughs> I'm just gonna say it. I'm just gonna say it. Coward. Absolute coward. I don't think it would take that though. Um, but if I dynamize my Scythe, like I said, I would have just won this game because I was at plus six. So. Yeah, I feel a bit cheated here. This is this is not okay. But with that said, you know, sometimes people get greedy. And I think my opponent wasn't aware that I would absolutely have survived a plus two flash cannon. I just feel like I should have, you know, made a game where I showcase how badly things could have gone for her or him. So yeah, I feel a bit cheated here. I won't deny that. <laughs> but yeah, you know, I'm there's a there's a bit of salt in my voice, but just because I knew the Scyther would have won the game had I used Dynamax right there and then at plus six. So um, it's my fault. I should have taken that route when I had a chance. And uh, but I wanted a good game, and I think we got close to that. But um, this team was tough, like without defogging, I am clear on the spot, and um, there was no way coming back from that. So with that said, as I wrote, of course, as always, can speak, thank you for watching, and uh, you know, as always, have a great day everyone, take care.